Well, here we have a uh, 2008 Precision Drive System EasyGo. I guess I don't explain that well in the videos, but if anybody wants to give me a call, I'd be happy to bore you to tears with uh, dissertation on PDS cards. But this is the one that's uh, programmable. I'll leave it at that for now. If anybody has any questions, uh, our toll-free number is 866-610-6656. Uh, and I'll be happy to explain uh, anything you uh, have a question on. Long story short, we've got 12-inch rims, 23-inch Kenda tires, and these are some super nice tires. This is a easy go exclusive and these tires just came out uh, with this combination of rim and these ones you won't find anywhere other than an easy go dealer we also have a brand new atomic orange corvette uh, atomic orange that is a painted body it's metallic some of the still pictures if you take a look at the uh, listing try to give a better uh, view of the paint itself it's got the american made uh, powder coated aluminum flip seat abs seat platform abs uh, foot rest as well lighter weight won't rust this is the one I go on and on about, but it's more expensive than the Chinese counterparts. But it's a, it's a safety seat, as you can see by the wraparound armrest. And again, the ABS seat platform is lighter weight. It doesn't have the sharp edges that some of the Chinese counterparts have, which is nicer if you've got children in the equation. Well, again, if you've finally seen already, this is a convertible. And that's something we've been doing for years. A lot of people with race cars, uh, trying to squeeze them into trailers, uh, use the convertibles, sometimes combined with the... Uh, rear seat with a fold-up footrest. We have those as well. Again, if you're not crazy about a convertible top, but I can't see why you wouldn't be, we've got uh, well, a FedEx truck pulling in. Adios to the FedEx truck. But, uh, gosh, I tell you, I need a sound stage. But, back to this, uh, yeah, we've got an easy-go lift kit. This is a factory lift kit. It's a 5-inch. And again, with those 23-inch tires, can you see how big these are in the profile? They're Kenda tires. They're super nice. Again, it's uh, an easy-go factory lift. It's a 5-inch uh, drop axle with brand-new spindles. We've got the uh, chrome uh, recessed lights. You can put a stainless steel uh, nameplate on. And the, uh, the convertible top comes down. It's very easy. Unfortunately, without an assistant, it's a little difficult to show and take a picture at the same time. But this is great when it's combined with a uh, sport windshield, which is a possibility. And if you didn't like a convertible top, and who wouldn't, but I don't know. It comes with a boot as well. It folds up. It can be taken off uh, very easily. We uh, put our own mounting system on, but we actually use uh, thumb screws here. And you can see this would be taken off in a matter of seconds. It's just uh, done by hand. Uh, two people obviously would be a much easier uh, way to do it, but since I don't have another person to show you how easy it is, I have to take my word for it for now. But this can come completely off the cart literally in less than a minute. And it can also fold down flat because it does come with a, a boot. So the whole top folds into the boot and it can be rested right on the uh, rear frame rails. And if you didn't like this, uh, we uh, also have black extended tops. Now we built something very similar to this that won a national contest. Uh, it was a little bit fancier paint job and it did have uh, some competition stripes painted on it as well. But uh, it had some different rims and so on and so forth. But we also had a, a black and carbon fiber roll and pleated uh, seat combination matching front and rear. Actually, this rear flip seat, uh, again, with the uh, black and uh, carbon fiber roll and pleat. It's quite a combination. But again, where do you end with these? The price keeps going up and up and up. So, you know, try to make everything... Uh, within reason. So if you didn't like, I say, if you didn't like these seats with this particular color combination, we do have that black roll and pleat, and obviously it would add more to the cost. We could also swap out the convertible top for an extended top. And again, we also, uh, with the uh, new body, we installed new uh, rocker panels and new chrome sill plates, which are a custom option, uh, just to accent the chrome uh, light kit that we installed. And uh, we also installed six uh, brand new Trojan black box batteries. And not much to get excited about there other than the fact that they are brand new and we also have an ST uh, sport uh, steering wheel center and a new rear bumper and new front shock covers and the list goes on and on but again if you didn't like the particular combination the seats can be changed the top can be changed we could take off the convertible top and put on the uh, factory original or again a black extended top would look nice with this not a problem we could do that as well so whatever you want, uh, we can certainly do. As a man once wisely said, we can do virtually anything you can pay for. So there you have it. Uh, again, a custom convertible. You don't see many of those. I can see that the straps on the front need to be adjusted to even out the top. But that's a 30-second situation. And again, this really looks sharp with the uh, sport windshield with the uh, top down. And uh, we even have some framing that uh, would allow you to ride with the top in the upright position. But again, it's a cost factor. And if you keep... Uh, 
building these the way I want them built, they'd all be $10,000 a piece and we wouldn't sell any. But uh, like I say, there's a, another overview. And I'm sorry, I, I love my own stuff. But then again, when you build it yourself, if you don't love it, you shouldn't be doing it. Well, thanks for watching this one, on top of all the others. And uh, again, this is something unique. We've built these for quite some time now. But you don't see a lot on the market. They are sharp, but uh, come see for yourself. Thank you.